Welcome back to my playthrough of Starfield. Thanks for joining me again. Uh, right before I started this episode, I went back in and I put on the uh, pirate ballistic outfit. I didn't see any reason to wear the other one. Didn't seem to help against uh, radiation. And I figure, I mean, we saw a ship land over there, so I'm going to guess that it's probably pirates or spacers or something. So I wanted to make sure I had uh, my most protective suit on, and this is it by far, I believe. So I don't really know if there's like a whole bunch of stuff to scan on the surface of our moon. But, um, I mean, there's certainly nothing living here. There's no flora, there's no fauna. There's uh, resources you can see there on the left. Don't know where they are or what they look like. Well, I guess I do know what they are. Uh, we saw in the last episode it's iron and helium-3. Apparently, um, neither of them is within scanner range. But we're going to run over here uh, just to say we've been on the moon. Uh, we're going to see what this uh, structure is over here. And then we'll go back to our ship and we will go to that, uh, that shipyard that's orbiting the moon. And I was kind of hoping that we could see it from down here. But I'm not seeing it, sadly. And I was also sad that uh, I couldn't see the uh, Earth from the side of the moon that we're currently on. Here we go. Here's some iron that I guess I could scan. Don't rush the scan. Want to overlook anything valuable? Don't rush the scan. Okay, I'm not sure why it says 95%. But I mean, we could mine this iron. Very dangerous practice shooting that cutter back in uh, Sarah's direction. I wonder if we could steal this ship. That'd be fun. I wonder what would happen if I did steal this ship. Could I just say to Sarah, hey, I've got this ship now. You go ahead and take the frontier back. I got it covered. Probably not. At least not now, anyway. Ooh, I love how high I could jump. That was... That wasn't even using the booster. Oh, there's some toxin in here. You never know when you might need some toxin. Oh, 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 oh. There's people walking there. They're not showing up as enemies, though. Hey, guys, what's up? How's it going? Hop, 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 hop. What's up, y'all? Bounty hunters? Uh-oh. Bounty hunters? Are they here for me? Remember I have that trait. I don't know if I could see that anywhere. Let's see. Where do I look at my character? Is it under skills? I don't think so. Is it under status? Character. Background. Traits. Remember I'm wanted. Someone put a price on your head and word has spread. Occasionally armed mercenaries will show up and try to kill you. But being cornered gives you an edge. When your health is low, you do extra damage. Is that could that be what this is? It's kind of funny to me to think that they just would like kind of like walk up here in a single file, not showing up as an enemy right off. But they are bounty hunters. You're a tough one to track down. Oh, huh? Wanted all over the settled systems for what? the bounty to match. Huh? Uh let's see, I don't think you know who I am, but you're about to find out. How about you just walk on by, stranger, and forget you saw me? It's too bad we can't see this guy talking. We can settle this peacefully. No one has to get hurt. Or what do you mean I'm wanted? Well, let's start with this. What do you What do you mean I'm I'm wanted? What? You don't know your own history. You must have done something to put all those zeros on your bounty. But it doesn't matter. I don't care what you did. Only what you're worth. I see. I see. I see. Well, uh, how about you just walk on by, stranger, and forget you saw me? Red. Anyway, since you seem confused by our presence, I'll break it down for you. Seems someone's gone and put an ash-to-sized bounty on your head. 
How many credits do you think fit in an Ashta boss? Good question. I'd say 2,000 credits would be enough to make us forget we ever saw you. Or we could just collect it the old fashioned way. I see, I see, I see. We could give this guy 2,000 credits. <laughs> We could ask who put the bounty on our head. We could say, you could fit way more than 2,000 credits in an Ashta moron. I don't know what an Ashta is, but... Uh, who put the bounty on my head? I'd, I'd just like to know. Does it matter? Why don't we just say your mother did it? I'll send her your remains with a card. Oh, you're funny. By the way, you could fit way more than 2,000 credits in an Ashta moron. Well, then how about we kill you and find out? Well, here comes trouble. Here comes trouble. Uh, let's see here. Let's get out a weapon. This looks like a pretty good one. Sarah, um, you might want to get ready to fight. Uh, I need to chill out. I need to chill out. Um, let's see here. So we've got four. Oh, 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 oh. We got four bounty hunters here. This could be a problem. Hey, leave her alone. Oh, man, he's taking a lot of bullets. Okay, he's down. One down. Oh, here comes some other. They're coming up this side now. Oh, 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 oh. Right in the crotch. Oh, this guy's got a lot of health. Oh, crap. Uh, he's down. Sarah, good job. Sarah must be like, what the hell have I gotten myself into? like to shoot his pack and send him flying. What are you shooting at, Sarah? Oh crap, I did not want to drop down there. Whoa! He's down. One more. Oh, you running away, are you? Yeah! Shara? Shara? Sarah's shooting him in the back. Nice. How much you want to bet she has absolutely nothing to say to me about that? Well, <laughs> when I said absolutely nothing to say, that's not what I meant. Ready oh. to head out there. Oh, no, there we go. Or did you still need time on your own? <sighs> Sarah. Bye bye. Bye bye. Well, let's loot these guys. Uh, full food spice storms and a rescue axe. I don't want either of those. those. Those are terrible things. Here's another body here. This guy's got Veteran's Navigator spacesuit. has a little icon near it, so it's got to be cool. Some credits. Don't stuck up on junk. junk. What are you talking about? That thing's awesome. I was going to give it to you. 150 credits. Ammo. Ecliptic pack. A Grendel. And some blue-collar off-work duds. I don't know. We'll pick them up. We got this guy down here. Is this the leader? No. Maybe that guy up there was the leader, the one with all the stuff on him. His body's over here somewhere. Is that is oh, that's a rock. Here's his weapon. There okay. So we've got a Grendel. And wanted. I want to look at this wanted thing here. Maybe we'll see who's who uh put out the bounty. Wanted. To all soldiers of fortune, I want Mental Fox dead. Not dead or alive, dead. A large sum of credits will be added to your account upon confirmation of the kill. To add to the game, this number will increase by a set amount every week. I know what you're thinking. The longer you wait, the higher the bounty. But ask yourself, will the next hunter be as patient as you? Oh, by the way, it said client unknown. I don't know if you saw that up there, right here at the top. Client unknown. We don't. We do not know who the client is. But when I picked that trait at the start of the game, I said that uh, our characters made some enemies in his never-ending pursuit of eliminating every pilot, pilot, pirate in the galaxy. He made some enemies, so it's not surprising to me that there would be bounty hunters sent after him. It's not surprising to me at all. They were actually pretty easy to take down, but I I would have to imagine, like, if they caught me out here in the middle of the surface here with no cover, that would not have gone that well. Satellite relay location discovered. Oh, there's, there's spacers. 
There's spacers here. Scummy spacers. Oh man, I hope nobody's up there. That would be bad. Uh, Sarah, what? Seriously, Sarah, what are you doing? So we saw that there is a spacer over here. I'm a little bit worried about somebody being up there and shooting down at me. Let's make a beeline for this over here. Some cool looking equipment here. We need if I could drive it, but I don't think I can. Here's a storage box. This giant storage box just has 142 credits in it. That's a neat looking ship. Do you think we could get around to that ship and steal it? That might be my favorite thing in the world to do if I could do that. You know there's going to be some spacers on the ship though, but why fight these guys out here on the ground? You can just go over here and fight them in the ship. Take the ship. That would be awesome. So I'm going to try to do. We'll see how it goes. Ecliptic Stiletto. Okay. Oh. I thought I saw movement. There's something over there, too. Showing up as an unknown. Ooh. Here's some... Oh, okay. Big iron deposit, I guess. Get on this ship. Let's hit F5 here since we were successful in fighting off the bounty hunters. Hmm. Okay, there's the ramp. Man, I don't know how many people are on this ship. It's kind of exciting. Let's get in the shadows. I don't know if that makes any difference. You would hope it would, but you don't know. Don't know for sure. You ready for this, Sarah? You with me? You with me, Sarah Morgan? This is a big ship, man. Oh, we're gonna have to go through this airlock. I don't like that. Makes me feel like a sitting duck. Well, we could board it. Let's try it. I'm going to do an F5 right here. Let's board it. That was fun. Now on. Oh, alarm going off. Where's your suit? Sarah, where's your suit? And where's your weapon? You got an alarm going off. Got a door here. Oh, the alarm went... stopped. Guess I can get my weapon out. Here's some stuff. So, I mean, I could just loot the place and be content with that. But, oh no. We're not going to do that. We're going to take this ship. UC Battle Meal Multipack. I mean, do I want these? Sure. They seem pretty cool. What are you... Sarah, I just think she's leaning in for a kiss. These paste sets. Restores 10 health. Hold on a minute. Watch this. There, I'm going to go into my inventory now. And I'm going to um, eat these. Oh, wait a minute now. Can I do it from here? Oh, there we go. I'm looking at my health right here go up as I eat these things. There, now we've got max health. That's fine. That's a good time to do that, I feel like. Okay, well, at least she's got a weapon out now. But she's all, like, freaking Han Solo with no spacesuit on. I still have mine on, right? Yeah. Because I'm not a moron. Okay, F5, since we're all healed up. These ladders always make me nervous, man. I mean, really, if you were trying to defend a ship, would you just stand at the top of the ladder and just pick off the moron as they climb up? That's what I'd do. 
I mean, that's what I'd do if I was trying to defend a ship. Uh, Erdebra light can. I mean, plus 75 damage resistance for three minutes. I mean, is this a thing that people really do? By people, I mean people who play this game. Do you really go through the trouble of drinking one of these before you go into battle? I mean, plus 75 damage resistance is pretty good, but for three minutes? And also, can I hotkey it? Let's see here. Take this. Favorite. Put it in slot seven. Okay, now when I get into fight, maybe I'll drink that and see if it makes a difference. Um... I won't take this ship. Okay, I'm gonna drink the drink. I just drank it. Oh crap, there's a couple of them in there. Stay down, he says. Nice! Oh, there's still more. Where are there? Was that just Sarah shooting? Still one there. Oh, there's a, a turret. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sarah, did you take them down? She's standing up. They're gone. They're gone? You mean they're dead? Oh my gosh, is this my ship now? Oh, look at this cool ship. No, he's not dead. Stick to targets. That was smart. One of the smartest things I've ever seen an AI do in a game. Um, taking all this stuff, taking this rifle, taking your ammo. Taking your Grendel. Taking your ammo. Hey, Sarah, could you clean this up for me, please? <laughs> clean up these bodies. Ooh, captain's locker. Doot, 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 doot. I mean, I could have just left it there. This is my ship now. Right? Xeno warfare tech. Ooh, this is contraband. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. What am I going to do with this contraband? I can't land on a planet with contraband. This is our cargo hold. I mean, I could just dump all my stuff in there and just take the whole ship, I think. Is there another level to this ship that I need to be worried about? This is my first time on a ship. On a, somebody else's ship, so I don't know. That was actually kind of easy. Oh, well, there's nothing up there. This is it, man. I believe this... Is this our ship now? I'm a little worried about the contraband, though. seat. So how would I do this? How do I give Sarah her ship back? Or how do I how do I take this ship and store it somewhere so that I could use it later? I don't know. But I am majorly intrigued. Well, Sarah? Go to F5. Well, let's see what happens here. Pilot seat. You are not authorized. What did that say? You are not authorized to pilot this ship. Huh. Uh, Sarah, can you pilot the ship? She probably has nothing new to say to us. Ready to head out there? Yeah, nothing new from her. Oh, did you... Okay. Uh, not authorized to pilot this ship. Um,. Well, is that, is that some kind of, like, anti-theft measure? Like, I need the keys or something to fly this ship? Um, 
do I need to kill the the spacer that we saw? Do we need to kill everybody who was on this ship before I can take it? What does this mean? You are not authorized. Well, that is a bit of a bummer. What's this right here? Attention. Huh. Um... Huh. You're not authorized to pilot this ship. I don't know what that means. And I really want to take this ship. So I'm going to consult the manual, a.k.a. the internet, and see what I am supposed to do about that. And I will be right back after I do that. Okay, so I did a bit of searching, and it, it, it seems, at least from what I could gather, that people actually aren't 100% sure. Uh... I read some articles that said that um, you you need to have the proper piloting skills in order to commandeer a ship. Um, there's different types of ships here. Uh, there's class A, B, and C ships. I don't know how to tell which is which. But apparently if you don't have the right um, skills, then you can't pilot the ship. So you go into piloting here. And yeah, so it says at rank three, you could unlock the ability to pilot class B ships, unlock the, and at rank four, you unlock the ability to pilot class C ships. So that is one theory that I've read uh, online as to why I can't fly this ship. However, I also read uh, some people who have said that if you have the wanted trait and these bounty hunters, if that's what these are, land and try to, you know, kill you, then you cannot take their ship, period. You just can't. And it was mentioned that um, these ships don't have, like, a kitchen, like a normal ship. Uh, there's, like, no sleeping quarters or anything like that. So maybe that is your hint that you cannot uh, pilot this ship. So super disappointing. Super disappointing. I was so excited. So excited when I did this. So I guess that means that I want to go ahead and take this stuff out of the cargo hold. Since I can't take the ship, I definitely want to go ahead and take the stuff out of it. Um, since it's not going to be able to use it for storage. Oh, that's strange. Huh. Interesting. Is this guy... I wonder why this guy is, like, colored in, like, if I scanned him, you know? Like, if he was flora or fauna? And why, when I stand here, does he show up with the death symbol next to him? That's strange. Yeah, now this guy's doing it, but he doesn't show up as blue like this guy does. Uh, if you know why that is the way that is... Oh, now it's not doing it. It's just some weird things about this game. I'm not complaining about it. Just just noting. All right, let's go ahead and leave this ship, I guess. That's so disappointing, man. That is really, really, really disappointing. I really thought that we got ourselves a ship. I was super excited. Well, um, there's a spacer over there. We may as well go ahead and take this guy out. And anybody else that's here with him. I don't think he came off this ship. Those were ecliptic mercenaries on the ship. <laughs> so much for subtlety. <laughs> uh, I don't know if there's anybody else out here. Oh, I guess this is blood from when he shot me. A uh, space adept coachman. Rare item. Okay, we'll pick up some of his stuff here. Oh, you would think that if anybody else, anyone else was around here, they would have heard the hubbub. The cave over there. They would have heard the hubbub and um, come running. But uh, nobody did.
Uh, isotopic coolant, I mean... I guess as far as I'm concerned, if anything has a description, I'm gonna take it. This crap here that doesn't have a description, I'm not gonna bother with. I don't know how long that will last, but... Right now, that's what I'm going with. Well, these stairs don't go anywhere. Could there be somebody up here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Well, I tell you what, being on the moon is kind of cool. Oh, 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 don't... Sarah... Sarah... Sarah, stop it. It's inappropriate. Uh, some metabolic agent in that storage box. Staple gun. See, no description. Weapon case. Oh, no. Uh, we need the advanced lockpicking skill to get in there. So was that one lone spacer the only guy here? Guess so. I can't walk over here. Whoops. Probably wouldn't hurt me if I fell from here because the gravity is so light. Well. Um. Let's go see. What's in the structure? It looks like there's a door here. We already looted that storage box. What's that? Uh, no? For a moment I thought that was a person. Wait a minute. Um, looks like I could get in from over there, maybe. Wait a minute, that is a person. I think. Yeah, but uh, my uh, I guess I can't scan through glass. Because I don't know whether he's a hostile or not. It doesn't show up as a hostile. Man, I really wanted that ship. I'm so sad. Ooh, spacer. This place ain't for the likes of you. This place ain't for the likes of you. What do you mean the likes of me? What does that mean? I'm gonna shoot you in the Leave head. Before I make you. Oh really? You make me what? I can't even see him. I think that's his head right there. My eyes? Is that what he said? <laughs> Where the hell are you? Ah, spacers must die. All spacers must die. Pi all pirates scum must die. All spacer scum must die. That was easy. I like it when it's easy. Uh, alien pie. A tangy mixture of minced alien fruits baked in a light flaky crust. It restores 20 health. Uh, calibrated Grendel. Well, I suppose they're not going to need it anymore. I suppose they're not. Pick his stuff up. Ooh. A safe we can't unlock. I mean, we'll never come back here. We're just we're just gonna have to live with the fact that uh, there are some things we're just never gonna get. Secret outpost. Is that a note? What's this? New Mission Mantis, read the secret outpost slate. Oh man, I'm encumbered. Okay, hold on a second. He's, got, he's glowing. So weird. Um, secret out... Dude. Whoa. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. I just wanted to jump over that guy. Uh, inventory, new items. Secret outpost. Loyal to your crew, I get it, but screw that. Beg, borrow, steal, kill to get to Denebola 1B. There's a secret outpost we're trying to crack. Once in a lifetime opportunity. You will regret it for the rest of your life if you don't get your ass over here. Whoa, for the rest of my life? Huh. 
Okay. Go to the secret outpost at Denebola 1B. That's actually a mission called Mantis. I don't know why. A dead spacer had a note about a secret outpost on Denebola 1B with a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity I should investigate. Oh, this is so exciting. So exciting! Picking up quests here and there. Just a random quest from a random body. Not quite on the random planet because this is the moon. Look at this. What's this? Uh, the classic rocks. Well, those guys look like they're having a good old time, don't they? He's got a space suit on. The classic rocks. Nice. Anything else good in here that I want? Oh, here's blockers. Nothing. Nothing. Snack pack. I mean, restores three health. Don't waste my time. Ooh, credit sticks. 181. 189. Pill bottles. Computer? No, not a computer. Well, I mean, it is. I can't use it, though. Sarah's just sitting there. She's like, oh my god, I hate, I hate traveling with this guy. He looks at everything. He has to touch everything. Calibrated navigator pack. Basic boost pack. Well, I'm over encumbered. Which is a bummer. But, oh wait a minute. Did I see something in here? Supply shelf. Medical injector. Tweezers. Eh, I don't want any of that stuff. See, they don't have any description, so I'm not going to bother with it. I'm not going to bother with it if it doesn't have any description. Hey, Sarah. I need you to carry something for me, will you? I'm over encumbered. Ready to head out there? Or did you still need time on your own? Uh. Uh. Is she not my companion? Can I not give her stuff to carry? What the? Um. Huh? Got it. You and me until we get that artifact. I think you might have some business to take care of first. Already huh? have someone with you. Yes? <laughs> Come back when you're finished up. You are currently on a companion's personal quest. You will need to finish that quest before continuing. What? Huh. Okay. You are currently on a companion's personal quest. So you will need to continue. But if she's with me. I thought that I was on her personal quest. Um. What? Huh. Well then. Um. So that's just fan freaking tastic because. I'm over encumbered, and I'd like to keep the stuff I've got. I really would. Can I still jump? Well, I sure can. So I could still jump even though I'm over encumbered. And running, if you look in the lower left-hand corner, you see it's using up my oxygen. So, all right. Well, hey, that's a bummer. I'll tell you that. Um. Can't fast travel back to my ship while over encumbered. So I guess I just need to drop some stuff. I tell you what would be nice, and, and maybe I need to start looking at mods already for this game. But uh, in Skyrim, there was a mod that lets you look at like volume to, not volume, value to weight ratio. And right, that's what I'd like to do right now. I'd like to drop the thing that weighs the most but is worth the least. And there should be a way to do it, because right here it tells you the value, right? But if I sort by... Say, i got to sort by name. But if I sort by weight... Well, there you go. So the game knows the value of an item, and it knows the weight of an item. So there should be a mod that allows for value-to-weight ratio. Because right now, that's what I'd like to drop. Like I just said. The, uh, and I tell you what's also incredibly frustrating right here. On this screen, unless I'm missing it, 
No, here it is. Here's the value, 3280. Okay. So that means the veteran's navigator spacesuit is worth 3280. And if I sort by name and I go down to the veteran's spacesuit 3280. Okay. So, sort by weight and Oh, good grief. Gr okay. Oh. Uh, Oh, for crying out loud. Okay, I used my mouse wheel. I couldn't grab that thing and drag it back up. Um, sort by weight, and then on the right, I could just look at the value. Calibrated Navigator Pack. I mean, when you compare it to this, this weighs 7.5, but is worth 62.38. Whereas this one also weighs 7.5, but is only worth 11.43. Kind of tells you that this thing has a very poor, we'll call it value to mass ratio, right? Pretty poor, just like this cutter here. Well, I'm not gonna get rid of my cutter. So I'm gonna go drop this thing. Just drop it. Drop it like it's hot. And then um mono propellant, this stuff is ridiculously ex uh heavy. Right? But it's an uncommon manufactured component, <laughs> which makes me want to keep it. Uh, these coachmen here, I mean, they're worth quite a bit, too, but I've already got a coachman. Pu oh, man. These manufactured equipments, this one's rare. Um, I don't know, man. I'm just going to drop this. There we go. Okay, we're no longer over-encumbered. What are you doing? <laughs> this still has some value, you know. Well, then pick it up. <laughs> Useless. Useless companion or not companion, whatever you are, I don't even know. Okay, we should be able to fast travel back to the frontier. What's the good word, Chief? Oh, okay. I want to get up before we go anywhere. Because I'm still walking around with almost max capacity. Hey, man, can you carry stuff for me? Yeah, boss. Let's trade gear. No problem. What you got? Okay, I can give him crap. Okay, good. So he can carry stuff. The problem with him is that he... I don't, I don't think I can make him my companion. I can't take him into the city with me to sell this stuff off, I don't think. But at least I could give him stuff because... Right now, take it easy, boss. Right now, I'm, you know, pretty much maxed out. And then my cargo hold, I think, is pretty close. Yeah, but yeah, my cargo hold is cargo hold is basically maxed out. Oh, this, I keep pressing the wrong button. I want to look at my inventory. All sort by weight. Okay. Um, this is a cool suit. Container is at max capacity. Okay, so I can't put anything else back in there. I still have 124. Because our next, our next mission is to go to the, not this. Our next mission is to go dock with Nova Galactic Star Yard. And I do not want to go and dock at this Star Yard at max capacity. Right? Because you know there's going to be a bunch of loot that I Pleasure, want. Captain. So here, you. Hey, you. Glad to be part of the team. Oh. Hi, Captain. Good to see you. Okay. So she's useless. So I'm not going to hire no names anymore. You, come here. What can I do for you, boss? We're going to trade some gear. Ah, have a few more things for my pack? Uh-huh. Yeah, I just need you to carry some stuff, okay? Uh, so I'm going to look at my inventory... I'm going to go to all, I'm going to sort by weight, and then I'm just going to give him stuff that I'm not using right now that I want to sell later. So I'm going to give him this, 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 this stuff, these, let's see, space adept coachman versus concussive coachman. They do the same amount of damage. Ooh, this is legendary, I'm keeping this. Okay, we'll give him this, this, this. This four freaking Grendels. 
these battle packs. I mean, they they give me a lot of health, but uh, an eight carry capacity for eight minutes. Do I want to hang on to those? Some duds. Um, so now we're just getting down here to some random stuff and then some books. So I'm still at 62. I mean, I'd really like to get that even lower. This stuff here, I really should just get rid of this stuff. Unfortunately, I can't drop it from here. You know, I mean, these stupid... Oh, this helmet. Oh, I'm wearing that, aren't I? Oh, no, not anymore. I'm not wearing it anymore. This is not worth keeping. Um, <laughs> these stolen eggs. Meal pack. I'm just dumping this stuff off on this guy. I'll, I'll deal with it later. Right. These restored 10 health. But I'm not really too concerned about health right now. My goodness, how much stuff up? Holy cow, look at all this stuff. This, these nickel and dime things I'm carrying around. You know, these are health items, so I guess I want to keep these. But so much of this stuff, I mean, I don't even know why I have it. So, yeah, one of these days we'll go through this or I'll go through this on my own. And um, just drop this stuff off or, or sell it. I mean, it says it's worth 155 I mean, I guess that's worth something. Yeah. I mean, some water. I mean, I'm never going to ever do any of this stuff. My goodness, I, I really can't believe how much of this stuff is in here. We're down to 49 which is pretty good. But, um, I mean, I, I don't. There. I want to keep the wine. Or the mine. <laughs> but so much of this other stuff, whatever. Just get rid of it. Okay, now we're down into the health items. I got down to 45. Good talk, Chief. Well, hopefully I won't forget that he's carrying that stuff for me. And even if I do, big deal. It's just money. That's all. It's just a bunch of money. Oh, I forgot we also have um, this captain's locker, oh, which is full. <laughs> so we're not going to put anything else in there. Okay. Well then, so like I said, our next objective is to uh, dock with the Nova Galactic Star Yard because we still need to find Vanguard Moara. But we will do that in the next episode as it's time for me to end this one here. Disappointed about that ship, man. Really, really would have liked to have been able to fly off in that ship, but we couldn't. Oh well. Regardless, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, why don't you let me know? Leave me a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. <laughs>